Hey guys, this is just for proof right here. I did go back in order to get these diamonds. Uh, I went back home, dropped off everything, and I was like, oh crap, I completely forgot the diamonds. So, just for proof, I came back for them. Now, I'm just let's, one last look around. I don't know how I really missed those. And I'm hoping I didn't miss anything else. No. Okay. Let's just check up here. No diamonds. No diamonds anywhere else that I can really see. Good enough for me. Just didn't really want to miss any obvious diamonds or anything. If you guys do. Oh yeah, and this gold right here. Again, as I was saying, if I do miss something, if you guys just want to point it out in the comments, I can go back and I can probably get it off camera. Or who knows, maybe I can make this big old deal and like a whole entire little tiny mini episode out of it or something. Just to go back on the adventure to reclaim whatever treasure it is that we missed. Other than that, I'll see you guys back at the base in just a bit. Real quick, I'm on my way back and I met an Enderman and I hit him with my sword and as you guys can see... Uh, never mind, it's not showing up there. But I kind of gave him the bleeding effect. And, well, since he teleports every he takes damage, he just kind of started spazzing out, and I never saw him again. So there goes our fun chance of the Interpolarial. See you guys in just a bit. Okay, guys, we are now officially back. Uh, not much has really changed. Apparently, we already smelted the new gold ore. Here are our diamonds. I went ahead and I salvaged some of our other equipment. Uh, I went ahead and I salvaged some of our other equipment. I also put up everything between the two missions, as you guys can tell. This is pretty much all that we have for now. So today, I don't really have much in plan, except for, like I said, maybe let's go exploring. Now, we did find a desert on accident last time. However, my inventory is full, so I could not really gather anything. So let's try that one more time and see if we can bring back any... Sorry about that hiccup. Bring back anything. Okay, so I just had to, real quick, get everything set up for us, and now let's go. So I know this is all just plains over here, but I think there might be a dark oak forest or a desert this way. I would be completely, completely okay with either, just to get us some special new materials. Ooh, and a pumpkin. What are these? Are these normal oak? Yep, normal oak. So, don't need you. Piggles! I don't have any wheat. Should I? Okay. I'm going to break a rule here. I know I said I was never going to use anything from the faction part. However, however, I think I'm going to break it just so I can bring out some lassos. Or to get these pigs back to our base for a farm. Hope you guys don't get too upset with me. If you do, well... It's my series, so too bad. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I don't make you guys upset. However, I also would love, love, love to have some pigs for a farm back at the base. Eh, who am I kidding? I'm not going to break any th of my special rules. Well, guys, like I said, if only there was a way for us to bring back those... Piggies. I had to think of what they were. The three little pigs, even though there were only two. So, the two little pigs. Ooh, and another tiny cave. Wow, we are just like rolling in the caves around here. Let's see, we are over here in a small little tiny baby desert island. Let's see if there's any cacti. Fly up, and no. Now, we are in the ocean. Vast oceans. No, yep, no cacti. So let's just run off and see if we can find any cacti or a fun new biome or who knows what we will just find off in the distance. Oh, an island. An island. What is it? Oh, no, it's not an island. It is land. That is the island. This is the land. Or is it? An, uh, no, it still is an island. Darn it. It's a... No, no. Oh, it is an island. But it's connected to land, or is this just a giant island? No, it looks like land. Killed a bunny. As I was saying, it looks like land. Had to eat something. Um, 
ba da bum Aha! We found mainland again. Now, we need anything except for oak and birch, because we already have plenty of both of those. Again with the ravines, I think we are just on some special little tiny couple of chunks. Ooh, and I see some cacti, so let's get this thing. Oh, and there's that lava over there. Of course, I did not bring my buckets. Of course. Well, at least now we know where it is. Let's just bring back some cacti for a farm at the base. 10 cacti, 16 cacti, 24. Yep, I think that should be just enough for us. Is this? Ah, oh, looks like a plains. It is. It is, guys. Okay, I think we now have some acacia saplings coming our way. Yes, yes, we do. So let's hurry up <clears throat> while we have tree feller and let's put it to good use. Okay, we cut down quite a few trees. We got a little over a stack of acacia logs as well as seven acacia saplings and there still are leaves decaying for us to leaf blow. Come on, come on, come on, come on, work with me, work with me, work. There we go. Let's get these last couple over here. Ooh, and pumpkins, right? I did see pumpkins. Yeah, I saw pumpkins. I hear that pumpkin pie restores quite a bit of hunger, so we may work on that. Using our brand new 12 pumpkins, since we already have a couple of pumpkin seeds back home that we can spare for the whole entire farming process. So, all in all, we found a total of 66 logs and 10 saplings of acacia. Which I believe is a pretty good find. Let's put these up. Oh, I want back my bow. Let's hope next we can stumble along either a winter biome, a jungle biome, or a dreaded, well actually not, not dreaded, but just dark oak wood, even though those things are kind of creepy. Ooh, and a lava fall. So let's air blast over this mountain. What is this? Oh, fancy, those Decidus Forest things, right? With acacia saplings, now that's the interesting part. And then here's a mountain with an acacia tree at the top. Uh, do I see creepers? <laughs> It would not surprise me. Apparently, I'm a creeper magnet. <laughs> okay, let's keep on doing this. Ooh, guys, some cows. Let's go ahead and let's kill them for some leather for our wonderful, wonderful repairing needs. Okay, sorry about that, guys. I'm back. I was just down there getting some experience from the cows. I don't know why, but my game just kind of lagged and then froze and kind of caught up to me. And then all of a sudden, poof, I was down there at the bottom of the mountain. So I hope that you guys not missed too much. Pretty much it was simple what you guys just saw then only it happened before killed cows, uh dropped some leather and some beef. The beef I'll turn into steak and the leather I will use to repair stuff. And here's some more lovely little cows over here. Oh yeah again this is the third time don't know why it lagged me out in the first time. Maybe just because of how many entities there were. And wow, guys. Now we have a dark oak wood forest. I don't know if we were just lucky or what. More cows. Apparently we are super lucky today. So let's knock down some of this. Oh, wow. Seven more seconds until Tree Feller could be activated. So let's, let's wait these seven seconds, guys. Eat some dang bread while we wait. Okay guys, so our tree feller ability is now back. Let's use it to knock down a couple of trees while we are still inside this forest. So there goes tree number one. Number two. Oh, and my axe broke. Hey guys, so my axe broke on that last tree, uh, as you guys can kind of tell. Hopefully, hopefully we can get two more saplings in order to be able to replicate a dark oak wood tree 
back at the base. Because <clears throat> you need four per a tree. I have an axe to cut down another thing. So now let's just wait for some more saplings to fall. Okay guys, so now we have waited for some more saplings to fall. We have a total of six, and our two trees that we had planted have we have regrown. That means we can probably just come on back later along the same exact path if we ever want to come back and just find this forest again. But I think I'm going to go ahead and head on back to the base, and I will see you guys once I get there. Okay guys, we are back, so let's add in this raw beef. Wow, I'm so just kind of blown away at the amount, the magnitude of wood that we were able to get, as well as the amount of saplings. This will be very, very nice. Let's remake a iron axe. Had to think what the heck I was about to make there for a second. And then I would say we need to probably expand out our base in order to fit some more of these resources we've been mining and getting. So I was thinking that we could kind of expand backwards into a little bit of an L shape here and then maybe form off like a bit of a second floor I don't know type thing and like maybe have storage and stuff at the bottom and then up top we can have like a bed and some other stuff I don't know we'll probably do that next episode as well as maybe spread around some of the love of the dark oak and the acacia until then I'll see you guys next time